With a new appointment in the Ducati World Premier 2025, Ducati has unveiled two new proposals for the Ducati Scrambler family to the public. Scrambler Icon Dark. The Icon Dark is the model that expresses the purest essence of Ducati Scrambler, a bike that eliminates the superfluous through its dark black looks, combining the minimal elegance of the second generation of Ducati Scrambler with the fun, light-hearted, and free spirit of the Land of Joy, of which it represents the gateway model. The essential and pure design enhances the timeless charm of the dark liveries of Borgo Panigale bikes. A bike that encourages you to express your personality even more, ready to interpret the tastes and needs of each enthusiast, using its livery to play with the customization possibilities that have always been a fundamental pillar of the Ducati Scrambler world. The sporty character of the 2025 Full Throttle is underlined by the seat upholstery and the black and bronze heritage livery, a color also taken up by the aluminium rims inspired by 1970s racing motorcycles and cars, and the black finish of the exhaust heat shields and front side covers. The lowered handlebar with variable section, a short front mudguard, a tail without the rear mudguard enhanced the tracker sole of the full throttle, embellished by the homologated Termignoni silencer. Ducati Performance LED indicators and Ducati Quick Shift up down as standard. Ducati created the first edition of what today we might call its on off road model in 1962, and at that time it was called Motocross and was based on the Ducati 250 Mach 1 Diana, but its styling was fresh and daring. Nothing to do with the same 250 Diana and the rest of the Italian lightweights. Taller suspension, a tinier tank with smart graphics treatment, and a short exhaust with what looks like a marginal silencer gave it a lot of extra grit. It was a positive success in the U.S. market. That suggested the U.S. Ducati importer, the Berliner Brothers, asked Ducati to develop a second edition, strongly inspired by the typical American dirt track racers. The iconic teardrop tank, the distinctive element of Scrambler, in its total black livery, creates a play of shades between the different materials, taken up by other details, such as the front mudguard, and the conveyors. The Ducati Scrambler logo on the dark stealth tank is more modern and in line with the aggressiveness of the matte black. The essential side panels and sporty tail fairing make the dark line even lighter and sleeker. Scrambler Full Throttle. The Scrambler Full Throttle is the sportiest proposal in the Ducati Scrambler range and is inspired by U.S. flat track competitions on dirt ovals. The side number plates reprise the livery and bear the number 62. 1962 was the year of the debut of the first Ducati Scrambler. In perfect tracker style and together with the sump guard, define a decidedly more aggressive look for those who do not want to go unnoticed. The new model was officially named Scrambler on both sides of the pond. It started one of Ducati's greatest successes immediately after it was unveiled at the Milan 1967 EICMA. Its styling remains an absolute icon in the domain of motorcycling, and only mechanical reliability problems put the Scrambler out of production at the end of 1976.